few occasions that can match the glamour and the excitement of an opening night at Cannes. And this premiere here at the Palais de Festival has special significance for the Australian film industry because it's only the second time that an Australian film has been nominated for the coveted Golden Palm Award. My brilliant career mightn't win the award, but it's yet another indication that the Australian film industry has come of age. The movie's also significant because it's one of the first to receive financial backing from the newly created New South Wales Film Corporation. And its three leading performers are women. Director Gil Armstrong, producer Margaret Fink, and actress Judy Davis. Hello. Gil Armstrong, you were said to have had some reservations about bringing this film to Cannes. How do you feel about it now? Um, well, I hope all the uh, uh, applause is true. It's a great honour, yes, to have it screened tonight. Yes. Do you feel that uh, it's well worthwhile to come to Cannes? Oh, well, I mean, for any director to have their film selected for a competition is a major achievement. Uh, a major achievement. So. Judy Davis, how do you feel about coming to Cannes, bringing an Australian film to Cannes and starring in it? Very honoured. Very honest. Do you think that this is really worthwhile? This is what it's all about? What's what's all about? <laughs> well, what making a film is all about. Well, it's part of what it's all about, and the other part's communicating to your audience tonight. If we've done that, then that's tremendous. What were you communicating to the audience tonight? <laughs> oh, see the movie. <laughs> no, no, the character, the, um, the essence of the character and the story. So. Yeah. Mark, Margaret Fink, one of the attractions of this movie was said to be that it was largely made by women and that it had a strong feminist theme. Do you, do you agree with that? Yeah, I have to. And, and you set out to achieve that, to do that? Um, yes, I think so. How do you feel about the applause you've got tonight? Oh, well, I hope it's uh, not usual. I hope it's unusual and all goes well for the film. One of the arguments going around can among some Australian filmmakers is that we've got to stop making Australian films and just make films. Was your film an Australian film or was it... Oh, no, Universal. Universal. And you, you it happens to have been made in Australia. 